Hey friends, welcome back to another video, another weekly vlog. It is Monday. I am going to vlog again all week, Monday through Friday. So it's Monday afternoon now. You can probably hear the music. Paisley's asleep. I've got her today. I've got her a couple days this week. I've also got to take my mom out a couple days. She's got some appointments. Um, it's just going to be one of those busy weeks. Today's Monday and it's been real rainy and dreary. It's supposed to be warm this afternoon. It's supposed to be sunny, but it's still gray and overcast. But I think, I think the clouds will be moving out pretty soon and it's going to be, the rest of this week is going to be hot and sunny and perfect beautiful weather so I really want to try and get to the pool one day soon I don't think I'm gonna be able to go this week we have too much going on but was that lightning it might have been lightning uh next week next week I think we're gonna to go to the pool because I'm yeah that's thunder um because I'm yeah I am a pool person I love summer I love going and spending my favorite days are days spent at the pool it's amazing so anyway hopefully next week but Thought that I'd pick up my camera and vlog this week. Last week we were on vacation, so we're just getting back into the rhythm of real, you know, real life. But it's we're about to start on our big uh, project. It's going to be in the backyard. In my last video, we were out there measuring. We're still making decisions on what we're doing, and we have actually scheduled Miss Utility to come and like tell us. It's if you don't know, it's like where they put, um, they mark the lines where you have like electricity and water and you know any any kind of pipes underground Ooh. so that you can know where to dig and where not to dig so and it's a free service they offer so they should be coming out this week and then we're going to get started that's going to be super exciting Paisley just left so I am free to make dinner now and I thought I'd just show you doing a weekly vlog what I was making for dinner each night give you some dinner ideas I found these at Walmart and I'm so excited to try them because you know I love Mexican food and oh, I actually saw somebody in a video in like a short she made them and I was like I've got to find those so it give, only gives you four in a pack but they're real thick it's kind of like a real thick flour tortilla it says soft and fluffy ready to fry and fill so you fry them in just like a half teaspoon of oil each side just you do like 10 minutes uh, two minutes so I have a couple packs of those and I'm gonna make some steak and some chicken cut up some tomato lettuce you know make some tacos some chalupas I am excited about dinner tonight I got um, three packs of those so we can have them a couple nights so for the chicken I'm just gonna put some taco seasoning and I'm gonna use this Kinder's buttery garlic salt on the steak Okay, those were so good. Marion is working out with his brother, so he always about the time dinner's ready is when he has to leave. So um, I made him the steak. I actually had chicken for me, but the steak I did put a few pieces in because it's so good <laughs> with that buttery, that Kinder's buttery salt. Oh my goodness, that's all I put on it. A little olive oil, it's delicious. And I don't even eat steak, but that is so good. So um, I had chicken and steak and he's just gonna have those. I'm gonna 
just clean all this up so that I don't have to get up and do it later. The dishwasher is almost totally full. Well, it might be full after all this. I'm not sure. So it won't take me but a few minutes, but I don't want to have to come back in here later and do it, you know? it is Tuesday morning and I am craving this fruit salad that I had from Chick-fil-a and it had blueberries which I do not have but it was strawberries apples mandarin oranges and blueberries it was so good I don't think they put anything on it but um, I just thought I would make one at home look at the size also of these strawberries <laughs> they are gigantic so I'm gonna cut these up cut an apple up I have a can of mandarin oranges I drained just put those in a bowl. I may put a little bit of lemon juice just to make sure the apples don't turn. And then I have some of that leftover chicken salad I made the other day. We've got a couple croissants left. So that is going to be my lunch. It's already lunchtime. I was going to take my mom to a doctor's appointment today, but I ended up not having to. So I have an unexpected free day. So I think I'm going to spend this day editing my vacation vlog, trying to get that done. There's my lunch. I did end up adding some banana to the fruit salad because why not? It won't come out. It is an absolutely beautiful day out here. Come on, sweet boy. Gotta move. I'm not going to leave the door open because it's not quite... Well, it's going to get warmer. But I think I'm going to sit out here with Clyde <laughs> and the dogs if they want to and do some editing out here. So this is my workstation today. I got my vacation video done and it is uploading going up tonight or tomorrow, but I couldn't resist. I had to go get the rest of the fruit salad. <laughs> it's a perfect afternoon treat. It's actually 
a little bit warm out here but it's not too bad it's not too bad and with the breeze it's nice the sun is going to be setting and when it does it gets really hot on the porch but right now i'm taking advantage of it so i don't think i've shown you my face today yet but um just yeah no makeup today didn't go anywhere it was actually really nice unexpected get day getting to stay home I got all my editing done out there and the video is scheduled to go live at six o'clock tonight if you haven't seen actually it is 608 now so it's already up if you haven't seen that vacation video it was a fun one so hope that you did if you did see it hope you enjoyed it um, I am making dinner now Mary and I have been talking about our, our project that's just kind of dominating everything right now because <laughs> we're trying to figure it out but um, I'm making these chicken patties just to get these at Walmart they're so good they come with the cream gravy and I love the cream gravy, but nobody else likes it. So I just made them in the oven. Usually I do them in the air fryer, but the fries are in the air fryer. And then I buy the brioche buns from Walmart and Chick-fil-A sauce. So good. Really good and quick dinner when I don't want to have to do a lot. Wednesday morning now I get married and I sat down and watched a movie last night we watched devotion I'd seen it twice I think but he never seen it it was so good but it's so sad but that was nice we just picked a movie and you know sometimes you need those nights so um, this morning I have to take my mom to the doctor and then I have to come back home and pick up Oliver take him to the groomer and then I have to go back and pick my mom up, take her home, then go back and pick Ollie up. So it's gonna be lots of running around. We're trying Petco today for his grooming because PetSmart, I've taken him there for years. He's nine, he's nine? Yeah, and I've taken him there since he was, since we got him when he was a baby. And for some reason, the last year, they've just been firing all their groomers and they can never get in. and. I actually had an appointment for him today and then my mom said oh I have a doctor's appointment so I went to cancel that and reschedule and it was a fiasco and they were like we actually don't have any groomers like none I was like well what if I just showed up on the day that I scheduled him for because I thought I could just reschedule and they were like I, I don't know we don't have any groomers I was like oh my goodness I started calling around and everybody is packed like full for the whole summer people aren't taking new pe new clients I was like, what am I going to do? So for a moment I had a mini panic attack because he is so fluffy and has to get groomed. But then I was like, well, I'll try Petco. And they had so many openings. They have so many groomers. <laughs> so we'll see, I'll let you know what I think of it. PetSmart, when I get a good one, I love it. When I don't get a good one, I don't love it. So I have mixed reviews about PetSmart. And of course you hear good and bad, like a lot of people have opinions about PetSmart. But um, for the most part, when I explain everything I want with him, they do they do pretty good. So Petco, I think it's a little bit more expensive because um, he gets like the teeth brushing, the teeth, the the whole bath, the whole shave because he's longer hair. It's more expensive. But anyway, we'll see how Petco does. All right, I took my mom, dropped her off. Her appointment's gonna be over two hours. So um, oh goodness, there's like a some kind of. Oh, yay. <laughs> I saw like flashing lights. We actually called the city to come and called Miss Utility to come and mark like lines in our, I think I might have told you this. Yeah, that's, they're here. So that's awesome. We'll get that. Uh, that's one thing checked off our list before we can start our next project outside. But um, I am having some turkey cheese roll ups real quick before I take Ollie to get groomed just going to scarf these down really quick and then we're gonna go over to Petco. So I just dropped Ollie off at Petco. They were amazing, so amazing. I already like them, <laughs> I already like the girl at the reception desk a lot better. I'm gonna run over, there's another Walmart on this side of town and I am looking for these shorts I showed you in my last vlog when I went to Walmart. These certain shorts, I wanted them in black and they didn't have them, so I'm gonna see. So I'm gonna see if they have them at that Walmart while I'm over here. We 
are home. They just went out. They got their lunch or their afternoon food and they went out. And you went potty, huh? Yeah, you happy to have your brother home. <laughs> she gets a little bit crazy. You're a little bit crazy, aren't you? Yeah, I love it. Um, Ollie looks so good. They did such a great job. Yeah, his tail is like a fluff ball. I've never had it like that. It's like this big poof. But it looks good. He looks good. Yeah. And it's not perfect, but it's hard to do. She said he kept sitting down and she kept wanting him to stand up and he was sitting. So it's four, almost five o'clock. So I stopped at Aldi, got a few things, went to Goodwill just to kill time. Uh, Walmart. I'll do a little, just a little haul. Show you a couple things that I picked up and then I've got to make dinner. Dinner's going to be easy tonight because I already cooked the ground beef, so I just have to heat that up, and yeah, it's going to be easy. So, uh, Marion loves these chips, the kettle barbecue chips, and they're like three something at Walmart, but Aldi has them for $1.95. So, I got three bags of those, because Jackson loves them too. Their grapes look amazing. I love finding grapes that are tiny, because I feel like they're less likely to be choking hazards, and they had... Like a dollar twenty nine a pound or something, really good, and they're real small. So I'm happy about that. I also got some more of these. These are so delicious. They have also dark chocolate, co keto coconut clusters, and I already st still have some of those from Sam's. And they're like the exact same thing, but these were on sale for like six twenty nine. They're normally like seven twenty nine. Also, when I was at Walmart, they had some things on sale for a dollar so check your walmart i don't know why something is up with the lighting in my camera it goes dark and then light um so i apologize about that i gotta figure it out um tons of stuff in like men's and ladies and children's that was a dollar so i found this shirt and it was six dollars and i love the color of it and then one of them was in the one on the one dollar rack and it was the exact size i needed so it was only a dollar it was on sale for six but then this one was only one and it was normally 14 dollars. so i think it's such a beautiful green color it's got these little like puppy sleeves so cute and i didn't find the shorts in black that i wanted but i did find the darker gray so now i have three of these and whoops that's the back i love the way they fit they have this elastic right here so love the way they fit and also i paid a dollar for this shirt for jackson it was normally ten dollars just like a light very lightweight long sleeve he loves long sleeves and pants and you know even in the summer and then i just got like a couple pants um at the thrift store i went to plato's closet and goodwill more leggings but i have these wild fable brand from Target and anytime I find the Wild Fable leggings I get them because they fit so good. That's that. I'm gonna go ahead and make dinner. I'm gonna make stuffed shells for dinner. So I already have the ground beef cooked so I'm just gonna boil the noodles, boil the water for the noodles and reheat that and then assemble them. That'll be easy. It's five o'clock now so got the whole neighborhood out here running around and they are barking especially this one. Bell Bell it's okay they can ride their bikes it's okay all right i've got the shells done the meat is done i've got mozzarella cheese and some pasta sauce i just put these inside the shells and then pour the sauce over top they're also good with ricotta marion loves ricotta he loves it like this too. this is one of his favorite things i make and it's so easy super simple i'm just going to put it in here and bake it i've also got some garlic bread baking in there too so i'm gonna put you on the tripod From my given disaster Speed away from the holy mind Pride That's where I never thought it would matter If I'm gone by now All my weakness keep on linger, linger on On repeat like it will be my favorite song Oh, I know I should be moving, moving on But you got me I keep on trying to defend still 
Go for our after dinner walk? Huh? Are you yeah. excited? Huh? Okay, let's go. So pretty. <laughs> Something's smells strong right there. Thursday. I have Paisley. She's just taking a nap. Patrick just got here. He's actually going to have lunch with me today. We're going to do his budget and have a lunch instead of dinner because he's going to see The Flash tonight with a friend. So he um, can't come tonight. So I just made uh, another fruit salad because I was craving it. <laughs> but I added grapes this time and the bananas. Smells delish. And we have leftover manicotti or stuffed shells from last night. So that is what Patrick's going to have. I'm actually going to have some little tacos. I have leftover chicken from my chalupas. Made myself a chicken and cheese quesadilla, big old bowl of fruit salad. Mm -hmm. Patrick's got <laughs> manicotti, fruit salad, garlic bread. All right, so I just showed you our lunch and now we are going to dinner. It is, it's later, it is almost six. We're gonna go out. There's this place in our town, well, close to our town where they have a bunch of food trucks and we've never been and I've wanted to go for a while so we'll go see if that's like really busy or if the food trucks are open I don't even know if they're open it's a Thursday so um, and if they are if they're closed or it's too crowded there's a pizza place close by that we'll go to but then we're gonna gonna go probably to like Home Depot and Lowe's and get a few supplies to start working are you doing he's copying me <laughs> get a few supplies to start working on or I don't know if we're gonna get stuff or we're just gonna look at stuff to start working on the backyard project. So that's the plan for tonight. So right there is where the food trucks are all supposed to be and there's only one. So it looks like we are not going there tonight, maybe on a Friday or Saturday. Guess we'll go to Marco's Pizza, why not? Oh, that looks delicious. So, we're not going to Home Depot because we looked online and we're going to probably try and order some stuff and have them deliver it because it's a lot and it'll be a whole lot easier to have them deliver it. So, we're going to go to the movies because I want them to go to see Transformers with me. So, um, the way we're going to go tomorrow night, but the theater for tomorrow night is already like a lot of seats full and tonight the theater's empty and that's what he prefers. So 
we're going to see Transformers. Got my cherry icy. We haven't had cherry ices in ages. We just had lots of pizza. Now we're going to have lots of popcorn. <laughs> Well, it is Friday now. We made it to Friday. Just um, showered. I've been debating all morning if we're going to go to the pool or not because they keep changing the weather forecast. Irritating. It's irritating. Um, it was like a 60% chance of thunderstorms right the same time the pool opens. And then they changed it to 40 and looked like it wasn't going to. And now they've changed it again it looks like they're popping up so the last thing I want to do is get out get everything ready get all the way over there pay to swim and then have it start thundering and we have to get out and leave so the pool just opened and there's this big line of storms kind of like to our west and they could possibly come here within the next hour so I just told Jackson I showered and got my, my bathing suit on and everything but we're gonna have to watch the weather. I don't know. Anyway, that's the plan for today. I don't know if we're going to the pool or not. I really, really, really was hoping for a pool day because so far we haven't been able to go where we've been busy and uh, we've just been too busy to go. And they only opened like a week ago, but then all next week, it's supposed to be like in the 70s and rainy. So all next week we probably won't go. And then there'll be another week and I just, I'm the kind of person that wants to spend every day at the pool. I went ahead and packed my beach bag a while ago, and Clyde thinks he's coming to the pool with us. You gonna go swimming? Let's add another one. <laughs> Ollie, you wanna go to the pool? He would probably love that. Oh yeah. Marion bought me this at the beach, and I'm gonna go put this, trade out my flag I have out there. I like this one a lot better than the one that I got off of Amazon. I also need to fix this bunting. One of you told me it's called bunting, and it flips off of one side. Those nails on that one, I didn't do very good, so I'm gonna go hammer those in a little better. That is so much cuter. And look at the ivy growing on that. I didn't even notice. We've got, I'm always having to pull up the ivy in this flower bed, but that is so cute. I won't pull that one up. And also these are just starting to bloom and they are so beautiful. This plant always comes back so big. Well, unfortunately, it was a good call not to go to the pool. There's a storm coming in. No pool day today, I guess, but maybe this, this is like one line of storms. I don't think there's going to be anything after. So maybe this evening we'll go out. There's, um, I've shown it before, but we have this like little mini golf place and they do glow in the dark mini golf on Friday and Saturday nights. And it's really fun. Plays with your eyes. Like it's really hard for me to do, but Jackson loves it. So we, maybe we'll go out and do that tonight. Go get ice cream or something. Food, everybody hungry? Okay, we'll get the bite. We'll get the food. Gotta feed all the fur babies. Okay. Where's my Care Bear? Where's my Care Bear? She's the OG. She's gonna be 16 next month. My sweet Claire. It's 5.30, gotta make dinner. I think we're gonna go after dinner. This is gonna be loud. Um, and do go in the dark mini golf, but you know, you have to wait till dark, so it'll be a few hours still. So I'm really tempted to get Mexican food tonight, but we went out and got pizza last night, so I'm gonna be good. And make dinner. What I had planned was breakfast for dinner.
it is after 8.30, we are gonna go do the glow in the dark mini golf and then they have like this, there's this ice cream truck. We're gonna go get ice cream afterwards, just have a little fun with Jackson. But I'll take you along, show you a few clips of that, I'm sure. But thanks for hanging out with me this week. I hope that you enjoyed it. Hope that you had fun. Uh, make sure to subscribe if you're not already. We are going to be starting on our backyard project tomorrow. So I'm excited to get it started, get it done. It's halfway through June, so I'm figuring it's going to take at least a month. But I could be wrong. We have to also take the weather into consideration and like next week it says rain all week. So <laughs> who knows how long it will take, but I will be putting those videos into a playlist. So, um, yeah, if you're, if you're wanting to see that start to finish, make sure that you come back and make sure to give this a video, this video, a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Bye, I love you guys. And I'm praying for you always. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. -bye. I don't know what is up with this bipolar weather, but it is cold. <laughs> it's like 87 degrees today. Come put a sweatshirt on. It is cold. Mm -hmm.